My name is Jose Trujillo, I'm a fine art painter and I'm coming to you from my art studio to share one of my, one of my inspirations, uh, thoughts that, that, I, that I've been sharing here with you that have helped me in my career, in my personal life and that I hope that, that by sharing them with you they may also help you in your, in your life and career and uh, business. So this one is about aiming high, okay? You want to aim high. You want to aim high as, as, as high as you can. And this, this concept comes from, you know, uh, aim for the stars and land at the moon. I think that's how it goes. Um, many, many of us, uh, creative type, uh, tend to aim high mentally, you know. And I'm not talking about mentally here. I'm not talking about imagining to aim high. Um, many of us say, oh, yeah. I remember when I was younger, I want to be the next, uh, the next Van Gogh, you know, the next Monet, whatever. You know? And then you, you, you sit there and, and imagine that. I think old kids do that. You know? um, I certainly did that a lot when I was a kid. Uh, one of the things that, we, that, that happens is that we get stuck on the, on, the, on, the, on the thought. And when I say aim high, I don't mean imagine yourself there. I'm saying imagine yourself there. But, but take it a step further. Figure out, not not perfectly, but what would it ha what would you need to get there? And what happens is that once you start doing that, everybody does this. Once you start doing that, you get discouraged, and then you pull out because it's it seems too painful, you know. And one school of thought that we've been taught as as a as society, you know, our parents taught it and then their parents taught us, taught them is, you know, well, don't aim high because what if you miss and then you're going to be discouraged? That's a, that's a horrible teaching. Whoever came up with that, <laughs> I, I don't know who came up with that, but they, they've created so much, so much uh, uh, negativity and uh, bad things in the world. This, that is a, a horrible way to approach things, you know. I don't think that a, a, a doctor who has a, do, a, a, a son or a daughter says, you know, don't, don't be a doctor. You know, you should probably, uh, I don't know, go uh, first start out as a janitor in the, in, the, in the hospital. And if that works, then, you know, then go and become a, an assistant. And if that works, become a nurse. It's, it's, it's ridiculous. Who would do that? What doctor in their right mind would tell that to their kid? No, you are going to be a heart surgeon or whatever, you know, <laughs> the, the, the highest position. I don't know what it is, but let's assume that it is because of my lack of knowledge on the industry. Um, and, and, and that's it. And if the kid does really bad and, and doesn't, you know, becomes a, I don't know, whatever, there's nothing wrong with it. But I'm saying from the, from the shooting of it, right? If, 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 if they land lower... The dad's still going to be like, oh, awesome, you know, he's got a secure job, he's going to be okay, he's going to take care of his family or, you know, whatever. But they don't start from the bottom and say, oh, let's, let's move up. That's a that's horrible uh, uh, plan. And we've been taught this. So what I'm saying is aim high as an artist or as a musician or whatever you do, the creative, the creative type, is don't think, oh, I, I want to... Play at the local show, you know, that's my, that's my dream. I go there every weekend and I hope I could play at the local bar. That'd be, that'd be awesome. Like, there's too many people that do that, you know. Don't, don't think like that. So, dude, I want to be at the Rolling Stone uh, concert and I want to open for Rolling Stones or, or, I don't know, be in the Rolling Stone magazine or whatever. So that you have this high, um, this high goal anywhere down there. You're, not, you're probably not going to make it. And if you do, you know, bless you. But anywhere down there that you fall, when you reach, when you, when you go for that high, you're going to land in such a great place that you're going to be like, why, why, why didn't I do this before? See, we're not taught this. We're taught, you know, just go, go play at the house party. And, and, you know, if you're a musician or if you're an, art, an artist, uh, you know, just go talk to, you know, certainly you want to get started anywhere you can. I'm not, I'm not saying where you want to get started. I'm saying, I'm saying the goal that you want to achieve. You can go to the local frame shop if you're a photographer or painter or whatever and say, you know, let's, let, let, let's exhibit here. Of course, you, wanna, you, wanna be, you, want, you want your goal to be in the Guggenheim or whatever, but you, you, you want to start wherever you can with that goal in mind. 
This is what I'm trying to talk about. I'm not saying I'm not saying go go to the the, the local Frank shop and 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 yeah, that's that's you know that's the goal. I, that's my goal because chances are you're not even gonna make it to the Frank shop. This is you see what I'm trying to get at. It's, it's aim as high as you can. You say I'm gonna be at the Met. I'm gonna be at the Guggenheim or whatever, and and. You're probably not going to make it there, but you're going to make it in, or if you do, you know, awesome. But you're probably going to make it in, in a high-end gallery. Just because your reach was so high, you're going to make it in two, three, or, or a chain of high-end galleries, and, and you're set, you know, for, you know, for that. Whatever, whatever, if you're an artist. But this is, this is the message, you know. Aim as high as you can, not just mentally, uh, physically, you know, with your actions. You say, okay, you're, you're a painter. I want to be at the Guggenheim. Okay, what can I do to move myself to, to get to the Guggenheim? Okay, well, I need to know uh, the right people. What are the right people? Maybe the people with the high-end galleries. Okay, well, I'm going to go get those people. And if, how do I, what do I do to get to those people? Well, maybe I just start talking to gallery owners in general, and they're going to lead me to that person. Or maybe I just go and make a trip and start, and start talking to those people, you know. Uh, you you want to do face-to-face if you can, you know. You don't want to... Uh, pick up the phone or, or, or send a letter. I mean, picking up a phone is even better than, than sending out a letter. I, I, I remember making that bad mistake when I first started. You know, hey, would you consider me? Guess what? Everybody, everybody's doing that. Don't do that. You know, don't. And, and if that works, it's probably because you sent in, I don't know, 10,000 letters or something. And maybe you landed one that by, you know, just by the sheer numbers. But um, anyways, that's another, <laughs> that's another topic. But aim high, you know, go, go as high as you can. And anywhere you land, it's going to be a good place. My name is Jose Trujillo. I'm a fine art painter. And thank you so much for watching.